just want to say thank you guys for tuning in. Oh, we do have a chat. Uh, JR, uh, what car are you working on? This is a 2004 or 2012 Malibu LT. So the, that's the car we're working on. And the car sometimes does matter, but sometimes it doesn't. Uh, vehicles will have similar parts to this. Uh, new gas, new system, or just gaskets? This is going to be just gaskets. Uh, this part was replaced a few months ago, and judging by this gasket, somebody did not put the new gaskets that I gave them on this vehicle when I brought it. So this gasket is extremely deteriorated, and it's completely shot. And I'm going to guess that this one here is going to be in roughly the same shape. Yeah, this one is, uh, it's not in the best of shape. It's already starting to deteriorate and it's not sealing up properly. We do have to clean these flanges really well. So we're going to set up and we're going to clean some of these flanges quick. Uh, you want something done right, do it yourself. JR, that is truer words never spoken. Uh, I brought it to a guy because I don't have a welder in my shop. Uh, it's, an, a, it's a tool that I'm looking at getting here in the future, but I just don't have it yet. And while I did that, I decided, well, why don't I just send it over to this guy? He normally does really good work, so I gave it to him. And now this is what I find is that the gaskets have been reused, even though I gave him new gaskets. Uh, this is really bad practice. You should never reuse gaskets, especially on exhaust because of the heat cycles. They just deteriorate the gaskets really rapidly. So I'm going to go ahead and switch over to my drill setup because this will work better for me. Thank you guys for tuning in on the Sunday. Normally I do my podcasts every Sunday at 1 p.m. And I try to go every Sunday. There has been times where I've had some family stuff going on or I happen to not be around to do a video. I do try to let you guys know when that does happen. But for the most part, I try to make sure I'm always here for you guys. YouTube's where I started. I've been here for many, many years and it's kind of where I want to stay. Hard to find honest mechanics this uh, nowadays. JR, you're true. You're absolutely correct. That's why I started this channel. I noticed that the dealers started getting even more shady. I noticed that mechanics were going along with whatever the dealers were saying. And I just, I couldn't live with myself anymore. And I'm like, no, this, this has got to stop. I'm going to tell you guys the truth and not hide anything. And you guys will know about that when I start talking about the new stuff, usually at the end of my videos. So always stay tuned till the end so you guys check the news. I'm just setting up now with, uh, with all of my stuff. I have to get my cords ready. So some of you might ask, again, why am I using a hammer drill as my, as my drill of choice? And it's because when I do have to get rusty bolts or broken bolts out, I use the hammer drill because I can put a lot more pressure and torque on it. So right now, I'm going to get a block of wood. These gaskets are toast. And anyone who knows anything about these gaskets already knows that this one has been in for a very, very long time. Horrible gasket design, but this is why you have to put new gaskets on. JR, keep it up, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to uh, make 